Space Kanska in the mid early to mid 70s. Kanska is a huge hydroelectric building company from Sweden. They promoted and built this project. Once they do this, the river ends. Our river was a, a beautiful river that flowed straight. But even before where there was river, you see grass growing. Because from that, the edge of the dam down, the river has died. And to the left, they deviate the water over tunnels, underneath a tunnel and over channels to another area. And then they join it to another area. And then I, I want you to see down there what's left of our river. And it's a here going to talk. Estoy filmando. I am filming and estoy filmando en este momento. Como ustedes, eh, as you can see, the, the river flows uh, freely from Boquete area and uh, with, with full force since in Boquete there are no, are no hydroelectric dams yet. As uh, Carmencita has said, the, uh, the Estrella Los Valles was built uh, previously in, 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 uh, during the last uh, two decades ago. And uh, Estrella Los Valles was a project built by the government back then. And uh, basically, they built only only the very necessary uh, 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 projects that they needed for for the national uh, for the national uh, uh, demand, energy demand. Primeras proyectos hidroeléctricos que se hicieron aquí, por lo menos en este río. Esto estamos hablando del año 76 por allá pero aquí se hizo un embalse y el río todo se va por el túnel por el túnel el río it murió goes, de ahí para abajo it goes through the tunnel and, and from there on completamente and, and from there on the, the river dies and disappears eh, y, y de hecho murió los peces porque de aquí para abajo si sí hay peces de agua caliente yes. de clima caliente yes. porque de aquí para arriba eh, hay otra especie de Okay, from here, from uh, from. Más en la trucha, pero para abajo sí hay mucha variedad de especies que murieron producto de que el río fue embalsado todo, el 100%. Pero en el 70 y algo no se hacía en este país estudio de impacto ambiental. Vamos a hacer un proyecto y se hacía el proyecto. Entonces, ahora nuevamente dos afluentes que hay de en este en este bosque, dos afluentes último, ya no hay más, más afluentes en el río Caldera, también están eh, propuestos para dos proyectos más. Translating, but, but, but you're going to, uh, va muy rápido. Va, what what the Sakiel is saying is that um, this, they dam the entire 100% of the river and caused the death of the river that we have many species of fish going down from the from this dam down and up we have less species of fish but all the fish died because uh, of the dam and of the hydroelectric project and that's a common thing. Whenever they open a project all the fish die. That's the first thing. All the fish die. Uh, they completely I don't know, they contaminate the water, they change the system they change the migratory, the interrupt the migration of the fish. And another thing Mr. Kiel said is that down on this same river basin there are only two left creeks or rivers that go back into the river and give it some water. And now they plan to do two more hydroelectric projects down there, Akla 1 and Akla 2. Basically what we're trying to portray, we will not have one single river left one single creek, one single um, uh, uh, water, water, system, water stream water stream left uh, untouched if they go ahead with all these projects being financed by all of them, the World Bank, the International Monetary Fund, um, the, the uh, Bank of European Investment Bank, um, 
big uh, US banks, all the major US banks. Uh, and and the Hong Kong, uh, the HDIC, the Hong Kong Bank, the Chinese. The uh, and the UK, is that HDIC? The CAF, the CAF, how is it called? The CAF, Fomento Andino. Uh huh, Fomento Andino. Um, the BID, Banco Interamericano de Desarrollo. The IDB, Inter International Development the Bank, Inter-American. They are all the ones promoting. And uh, why they are promoting this project is because uh, they said in the protocol, you know the climate change protocol, that hydroelectric projects were a clean source of energy. The message that we want to send out to the world, that hydroelectric stands and hydroelectric projects, big or small, because the big ones will not produce a lot of contamination and methane gas. These small ones like this destroy the ecosystem and definitely they are never, never a clean energy mechanism. They are a horrible, dirty, mean, uh, they contribute towards climate change and there is no way that they should be promoting this type of project in our country and destroying the environment and contributing even more to the global uh, climate change. That's what our message is. Yeah. This river alone goes already by five hydroelectric trucks. Mm -hmm. Already uh, built. Uh, this is the first one. Uh, mm -hmm. We'll see tomorrow some of them. A couple of them. Mañana vamos a Such as ST and in, in, uh, Dos Mares. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And there are, uh, okay, there's San Ramon, there's Salto Caldera, there's Los Naranjos, there's Salto Lino, there's Omar. Five more. Mm -hmm. the, the Seis. Six more plans. Seis proyectos de aquí para arriba hay propuestas. Up to the first of the river. Okay. Well, thank so this is just one river system, and this is the same thing for every single river system in our province, and every single one left in the country too. En cada uno en toda la provincia y en el país. Okay, so now we return and we come back to the new.